Road here. To everybody that subscribed to my other channel, that's great. I've heard a lot of feedback that I should start to bring some tips to this own channel. And we will. Today, we will not be doing a trick throw. Yes, we will. We will be looking to get more spin on our backhands and forehands. Let's begin. Our Instagram name that throw competition is over. Shout out to KCC for naming the forehand, the forehand spin wheel, and for Christogram for naming the backhand, the spin cycle. Head on over to Instagram for more bonus content, giveaways, and competitions in the future. All right, so we wanna put more spin on our throws. The first thing we're gonna do is scroll down a little bit and hit the like button. That always helps. Gotcha, okay. Hold it like a backhand, and instead of bringing this back here to throw it, all we're gonna do is snap our wrist back, come up, and we're just giving it a lot of spin like this. Once you have the spin here, you're gonna catch the rim with your middle finger and let the disc continue to spin like so. Now, if you don't have a fingernail, you can use some soap to give it some less friction. Highly recommended, or just throw it in the rain. Once you have the disc spinning on your finger, you're just gonna throw a normal backhand and watch the magic do the work. Now, when you just start ultimate, it's always beneficial to have a righty backhand and a lefty flick, all right? Of course. So, to throw this one, you're gonna do the exact same thing where you give it a lot of spin on this backhand, but you're gonna catch the frisbee now with your middle finger on your left hand and throw the flick out to space. Thanks for checking out these two tips to get more spin on your throws. I hope everybody can take this back to their games. Again, I don't recommend that you try these in a real game, but like these videos right here show, if you do cool stuff, people retweet it. So go on out there and try these throws in your next game. 